Hey y'all, do you know Exotic Squirrel King? Just wanted to update y'all, because since our last get together, a lot's happened here in the life of our little squirrels. What we've done is we've made them a little squirrel condo, and we've moved them outside into a pecan tree here, stuck them up in the air, and what's happening now with the squirrels? They're completely wild, okay? Wild animals, okay? So this is not like before. We're not inside in the comfort of the home. We are now outside. So when you go to visit squirrels in the wild, what you gotta do, you can't, you gotta sneak up on them, okay? So, you know, you need camo. You gotta get camouflaged. You gotta blend in with your surroundings, okay? And I take my work serious. I'm, I'm a professional squirrel king. So, you know, you gotta, you gotta look the part. Uh, I'm not looking for a fight, okay? But if they bite, Squirrel King bites back, okay? So what we're gonna do, we're gonna try and sneak up real quiet, okay? I'm gonna bring some treats. I know that they like, they like some of the, some of their special treats. I got a bag of nuts. And we have put them in a pecan tree, okay? They're living now in, in, the, in the lap of luxury, okay? Between you and me, I'd be fine living up in a tree, okay? Um, there's, there's not four walls to cage you in, okay? So if you can see here, we got to get real quiet. Sometimes you get you don't want you don't want to sneak up on a on a squirrel. You you startle a squirrel, it might be one of the last things you do. Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't like ladders. Okay, we got any baby squirrels? Is anybody home? Anybody in there? <laughs> Apparently they're not quarantined. A lot of times they go out during the daytime, and uh, you know they forage. Um, some people call it stealing. I say they're, uh, they're opportunists. It's a waiting game. Like any of the big hunters will tell you, uh, patience is a virtue. Um, when you're dealing with squirrels and visiting, um, you have to, uh, like I said, you bring nuts and you display your nuts so that they can see that you're a friend, okay? That you're not a foe, all right? And I, I, I know what you're thinking. They probably don't even see me, right? Because I'm just blended in with my surroundings, but that's because I'm a professional. You put your fingers in a squirrel hole, <sighs> brother, you got trouble, okay? We're gonna get quiet. We're gonna bring it way down. <sighs> I remember my first squirrel hotel. <laughs> Back in the 70s, I put it up in East Texas. Um, it was hot. It was real hot. Um, there was a lot of mesquite. <laughs> A lot of mosquitoes. Um, we had both kinds, mesquite and mosquitoes. Sometimes you get lucky and somebody's home. Hey, hey y'all, don't go away. I got, I got some nuts for you. We got some nuts for you. Come on out. Where's my little squirrel? I probably will give him some of the nuts I brought from. Hey, I'm bringing gifts. Oh, they're shelled. They like their pecan shelled. Um, here you go, little baby. There you go. Hey, how you doing? Come on out. I'm just here visiting. They don't remember me. The memory of a squirrel is very limited. Um, once they get in this stage, their mind goes, okay? Their mind goes. They don't remember their friends or their relatives, okay? Hi, squirrel. Hi, baby. There you go. Well, let's just give them a little room. We'll give them a little room. I try to zoom up on them here with my camera. Hey, hey, baby. There, baby. You gotta be quiet. We gotta get real quiet. If you listen, you can hear the squirrels. Oh, they're talking. Oh, they're squeaking. What? No, that's the sound of a squirrel getting getting mad. Cause I'm a little too I'm a little too close to his house. This might be one of the last posts with this group of squirrels because like I said, they go wild. Once they go wild, child, that's where they stay in the wild. Cause uh I ain't no Oklahoma wildlife napper, okay? We don't steal them, we don't breed them, we just rehab them, we let them go back into the wild. So this is just part of the, it's heartbreak. Squirrels will break your heart. I'm not gonna lie, squirrels will break your heart, okay? But it's just part of being a squirrel rehabber and being the squirrel king, okay? What? Oh, shit, whoa, hey! Oh, hey, man, hey, man. I'm gonna have to cut this short because uh, I think I might've broke some of my vital organs. But uh, until next time, this is Dino Exotic, Squirt King.